<laughs> and we are back. Uh, last time, we... I think the sun blew up. This time, I'm gonna go do, uh, explore some more stuff. I wanna finish exploring everything that I... haven't. I'm just gonna be a second to remember the controls because... Uh, it's been like a little over a week. Somebody down there whistling. Whistling? harmonica ing. Hmm. Uh, right. There's that, there's a, there's a, that one place that I want to explore. That where I was last time. Get me out of here, get me out of here, get me out of here, get me out of here. And then I, you know, uh, yeah, the place where I ended the video. That's where I want to be. That's where I'm going to go. Um, uh, so hold, hold left, turn to left off. I'll up. Just remembering, just remembering how to do it. Where the hell? It was near the mountains. Now, where the hell are the mountains? Here's the, here's the, uh, the button that I thought it was. Right, okay. Right, there's the mountains. I think this is the spot. So I especially want to explore down here. I still don't know if like hitting the ground too hard damages the ship. Probably does. But that's another perfect landing. Uh, nope. Get me back in. I need to put on the suit. Yep, here we go. There we go. What is in you? Remember the flashlight button. That's good. Well, nothing to it but to start exploring. <laughs> well. I immediately fell all the way down. And now I'm kind of really... <laughs> What am I looking at here? I can explore underwater in this thing. Oh. Oxygen tank refilled. Alright, get me out of here, though. Yeah, this is kind of horrifying. <laughs> Come on. Come on. Okay, I am permanently stuck here forever. What's that? There we go. Well, this kind of hurts my eyes. Okay, we're up here. Ooh. That's good. Bunch of rocks. What's well, over there? Where, did, where were we? Where did we come from? I think we came from down there, and then I tried to jump over there and failed. Which means there is more to explore underneath where I was. But more importantly, I could go this way right now. Ooh, some text to translate. Uh, from Iona, uh, I'm still amazed by how much ore the Ash Twin Project requires. Oh yeah? 
from Saisad or Saikad or Kaikad or whatever. Isn't this the ore for the remaining towers? Isn't this the ore for the remaining towers being built on Ash Twin? The completed towers I've seen are quite large. Ooh. Uh, no, the material for those towers is all being taken from Ash Twin. The ore we're mining here will be used to craft an immensely thick project, pro projective, protective shell that will physically seal off the chamber inside Ash Twin's core. From Coleus. I'm relieved by our clan's decision to use Timberhearth's ore only for constructing the shell. If, eventually, life on this planet were to evolve to the point of advanced metallurgy, I'm confident we will have destroyed their ability to create. And then from Kaikat again. Uh, if they're sealing off all entrances, I hope they've planned ac accordingly. <laughs> Good thing that pun translated. I thought you had forbidden your apprentice from making puns, Coleus. How else would he improve? What's this? I'm taking this. Okay, I can't still just put it down if I want. Okay, but what's this way? I can kind of use the, uh... Whoa! There we go, that's... There's just de facto sprint button. Already holding scroll. Drop scroll. Scroll does not fit. There you go. Wait, hold on. Urgh. What are you? You good? You just sat there and died? Pick up Ash Twin Project Stone. Okay. Ugh. Ugh. Yeah, this is horrifying. I don't know what's happening. Okay. Uh, too close, and it's untranslated. Oh, there we go. Uh, Yarrow. My gratitude for the last shipment. Oh, I know. This ore should be the last we'll need for the Ash Twin Project. Once we finish the shell that seals off the central chamber, we'll check to ensure there are no longer any physical entrances. Rami and I will be checking the interior and then the exterior for cracks. Our final safety check. Oh, come on. This is exciting news. Can I offer an extra set of eyes for this final check? Specifically, mine. If my work here is complete, I'd be delighted to help. We'd be grateful if you would. The more eyes, the better. As the smallest flower opening in the shell that protects the Ashtwin project could lead to disaster. Noted. So I put it down here and it just yells at me. All right, I remember. I forgot I could do that. Come back. I don't know what's happening there, but it kind of scares me. So I'm gonna grab this. Scroll does not fit. Okay. Scroll does not fit. Okay. Anything behind you? Wait, right, hold on. Oh, I tried. Uh, where do you go, then? So something on Ash Twin. They're, they're, they're creating a shell that can't just... Can't leak anything on one of the Ash Twins. Right, I can... I can do that. I can put it in there, but why? But why would I? You good? Ah, this is where I was. Ooh, hold on. Uh. 
Ugh. This place sucks. Yeah. Can I like climb in you from here? No. Okay, I have to go in through there. I don't want to crawl into those Junji Ito esque holes in the wall. All right, let's head back up. Actually, you know what I could do? Uh, what's the button for it? Equip Scout Launcher. Uh, no. Launch bug. I just use it to get some lighting down here. Is there anything interesting down there? No, it's just a very, very flat bottom. Nothing particularly interesting uh, that I can sell right now, aside from these holes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Alright. I want to get in underneath where I was. Well, I guess first I want to get where I was. Only reason I didn't make it last time is because I messed up, but you know, whatever. Also need to refuel soon. Ish. There we go. Oh, no, 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 no. Made it. <laughs> Alright, now why am I here and what can I do here? This is just a, uh, this is just a ramp down or whatever. Okay. Well, I think we, I think we've gotten all that we can from here for now. So I'm going to head back to the ship and, uh, explore a little planet somewhere, yeah? Also, I'm bringing this with me. I don't know what it does, but I'm going to bring it. Let's hope that I could actually land where I need to. I don't know if flying through this waterfall will, like, halt my progress any. Made it. Alright. Hey. I'm back. Now I have a cool trinket. Put you down. Can I put you down? Anywhere in here? No. Okay, fine. The Know My Minds. The Ash Twin Project. Yep, those are some things that I discovered. What's the rumored entry about? Am I taking the jewelry talks about calibrating some sort of device on the Addle Rock? That's the moon. I remember that. The Know My Mind Ore from this site. To. The Nomai mined ore from this site to craft a protective shell, designed to physically seal off the central chamber inside the ash twin. Once the shell was finished, the Nomai checked to ensure there were no longer any physical entrances or cracks. I can make a crack if I try hard enough. I could get in there. Hamming my ship in. The central chamber inside ash twin was physically sealed off by an immensely thick protective shell. Yeah. Alright. Uh, let's go somewhere. Can I... Can I put this down? Alright, I'm just gonna put this down right there. I know where it is if I need it. Alright. Uh, I don't think there's anything out front that I need to explore anymore. So, let's... I guess I'm just gonna keep flying around, because I don't... No. What I, ooh, that's... Is that something? Yeah, that's what I was looking for. I don't even need to look at the... This view. To be able to land. Hello? I pe creepily peek through the window. Ooh, what are you?
You don't mind if I just park out back, right? Is that tape? Satellite angle 40. Satellite angle 137. Satellite angle 350. Okay. Kind of ominous, but, you know, whatever. Play recording. And we are recording. <clears throat> it's been two days since the launch of the Deep Space Satellite, and I'm about to view the first batch of photos. Let the record show that on this historic day, Outer Wilds Ventures has... Uh, they're printing! They're printing! There they come! Stars above, would you look at that? There's Brittle Hollow, and look, there's... And look there, that's Hollow's Lantern. And there's Giant's Deep, and the Quantum Moon. I'm speechless. Completely speechless. Every single astral body in our magnificent solar system. Looking stunning from every angle in each of these three images. And in color, no less. Oh, this is art. I could stare at these photos forever. Doesn't Timberworth look tiny from... Hold on, what is that? That can't be right. I mean, that's not even possible. Am I interpreting this photo correctly? What's even stranger is it doesn't show up in any of the other photos. Just this one. Well, there must have been an equipment malfunction. I suppose. Only sensible explanation for it. I'll radio Gabbro and ask them to go examine the satellite's lens from de for defects. Which one? Which one has the funny something in it? This must be him looking for defects, right? Maybe? I don't know. Which one of these photos has the funny something in it? Well, I noticed that this one is the only one that has, like, an extra something near... near. Us, I think. I think this is us. So, that might be what is being talked about there. Might also not be. Can I steal some printer ink? Might need it. It's expensive. Hey! Yeah, I thought so. Now, can I climb this thing? Probably not. I'm gonna go explore where this path leads. Can I pick you up? No. Well, ain't this quaint. That lit really easily. Alright. <clears throat> despite my checking... Despite my checking on them at least a thousand times over, the images are still not ready to print over in the radio tower. Well, it's likely that... Well, it's like they say. A watched satellite never transmits data. Ha, ah, that's a little joke for you, Journal. No one says that. Someday I'll have to study the mechanics of how time manages to slow to a syrupy crawl whenever I'm anticipating something. In the meantime, I have turned to Gavro, our resident expert in leisurely willing away the hours, who recommends the following. Gavro's foolproof steps to for dozing off. One, light a nice, cozy campfire and get comfortable. Gaze deeply into the serene warmth. Let time begin to slip away as you allow the flames to lull you into a peaceful slumber. If Gabriel knew I'd taken those, I'd probably think I'd finally ch cracked. But I refuse to accept sass from an astronaut who deliberately burns their marshmallows. I could doze off, but why would I? I don't know what that grants me, and I, I'm kind of on a time limit right now. Yeah, that thing's looking angry, Yuri. Alright, let's get going somewhere. I'm gonna do a, another flyover of this planet, see if there's anything else. And then I guess the next step is to head to the, uh... Head to the, uh, moon. What are you? Oh, that's just the entrance to that. Have I explored you? I think I have. Yeah, you're the teleporting signpost place. Yep. Um, 
mountains, which kind of scare me a little bit. I could explore them, but I don't know what I'll get from them. And the only way I could see to explore them is by trying to fly down the barrel of that geyser. Which doesn't seem good. Ooh. There's the crashed thing that Tektite is talking to. And there's the... Oh, hey, if I light the... If I light a... Man, that smoke goes high. Alright, I see the point of those, I think. Or rather, I see what lighting a fire could... I think we're orbiting. Uh, Alright, where is the moon? Ow. Where is the moon? Let's head to the moon. Me looking around like I could just casually see it. Hello, moon? Ooh. Oh, none of those are the moon. Ooh. There you are. I see. I saw a, uh... I'm going a little bit fast, aren't I? Come on. Come on. Man, good thing, uh... I'm so good at... Physics... Oh, come on. Nope. Down. I say I'm so... so thing, good thing I'm so good at physics that I... Oh! Kind of forgot where the moon was. Well, I don't think the ship's going anywhere. Probably put on you, huh? <sighs> Fix that. What else is broken? You? Okay, fine. You fixed? You done complaining? Alright, now where the hell are we? We <laughs> made a little bit of a crater. But that's only because... Uh, I had to. I hope they didn't see me do that. Good thing nobody else... God, that was scary. This is so trippy. Let's go and... Uh, I'm gonna try and get closer to something. I probably could walk around on this place pretty quickly, but... Right, let's... Let's match our velocity to this thing. That'll be a little bit easier to... Can I get a little bit of height, please? Thank you. Nope. Come on. Look, there's a good something to land next to. I'm just going to light it. Land naturally. Uh, please put on the suit. I feel like I'm going to forget to do that one of these times. I just fell in a hole. Hey! I hope you didn't feel the impact. What is that? What is that? Well, I can't walk fast enough to get it, get to it, so... I don't know if I fight Sydney. Yeah, it's probably... Him. The music is getting intense, so I'm like... I'm, and the sun is looking quite, uh, you know... Because I want to... I want to... I want to know if this is anything. Ooh, what is this? Yep.
Yeah, this seems bad. Hmm. Nothing. See ya, harmonica. Oh! I spent a maybe I spent a little bit too much time uh, hanging out with the uh, hanging out in the no my minds, but you know what? I got a lot of good info from there, kind of. Also, I just checked my timer, and it seems that one I don't know cycle, I guess would be the proper term, is about twenty-five minutes. <sighs> Well, I'm back. Uh, you know the ship is a death trap, right? Well, yeah, it's a death trap, but it's a really, it's a really powerful death trap. What? You suddenly care about safety now? No. I forgot I could probably go down there and like talk to some of those guys. Actually, let's talk to some of the townspeople about the loop that's happening. Especially Doctor Doofenshmirtz or whatever. The guy with the voice lives the lives on top of the museum or whatever. I want to talk to him about it. See if he has, he has anything new to say. Hey, kid, I'm t stuck in a time loop. All right. Uh, I guess I'll only talk to the most important people. I really need to like. I just like quickly looked at the my uh my recording to check that I was recording because this really isn't the type of this game doesn't like do auto saves or whatever. I can't like unlearn any knowledge that I learned, so I really need to be careful that I like actually do record this because there are, have been a couple of times where I've like forgotten to record an episode, then I'd like go back and you know play it again. Really can't do that with this, huh? I'll try not to. Die. And I also need to learn how to land better, I guess. I guess I can see what they mean by you might want to use a controller here. But also at the same time. Right, you guys are going to be talking about the statue. Hey, Doc. Time loop. Uh, never mind, I'm good. I actually hate you and I'm leaving. All right, fine. Well, that's that's a little bit of time wasted, but whatever. Let's let's land on the moon. Let's go to the Addle Rock. Yep. Yep. I punch him in the face and then I run. It's a time loop so I can get away with anything. Alright, where the hell is the moon? Should I try and wait or should I go and seek the moon out? Let's go and try and seek the moon out. I'm coming for you, moon! Nope, nope. Oh, where's the sun I, I saw? There you are! What is that? Oh, keep walking onto it, please. And don't orbit around it. Alright, there seems to be a lot that I can, uh... Let's... Let's land next to this guy. Person. Let's land more gently this time. Hold control a little bit, just so I make sure that I've landed. All right. I put on the suit. And I do the pre-flight checklist? Check that boost for me quicker. What is this? I don't think I've ever checked this before. Weird. 
Wait, what? Jacob Opus can be triggered by a second pro button. Translator auto equip. Is this just another settings menu? Freeze time will trans. Yeah, this just seems like another options menu. It's weird that I could freeze check if I want to freeze time or not by uh, doing a free pre fight checklist. I'm leaving. Trees detected. Oxygen tanks near filled. Refilled, even. Right, I forgot that was a mechanic. Or, I just learned it was a mechanic, but I think I read something about that. Hey, bro. Uh, you didn't, you didn't remember the past, you know, the past loop? You know, the one where I crashed? Oh, hey, it's you. Ground control didn't tell me you were launching. Long time no see. Oh, I didn't tell him. Actually, I guess it's been a long time since I've seen anyone. Uh, don't the other travelers come by? No, Lunar Outposts sell more traffic back when their ships were less sophisticated and needed more frequent repairs. Nowadays, it's mostly used just to keep in a set of eyes on things. Sometimes Chirk comes by to say hi, but Gabbro is Gabbro. And you know how Ryback feels about unnecessary space flight. Uh, don't go. Uh, I mean, anything else you wanted to ask? Seems lonely up here on the moon. A <laughs> little. I'm in touch with ground control, or pills and gossip mostly, and they radio up to chat now and then. And then when ground control forgets them up here, as they usually do, I launch my little scout at the village. They forget about you? I don't blame them. For one, I don't check in as often as the other travelers since I'm always in one place. And it's not so bad up here, really. At least it's peaceful and quiet. You don't always get that in our solar system. Yeah, you might want to might want to get as much relaxing in as you can for a while, because you won't be able to. Is my goal to stop? I don't really know what the end game of this game is. Is my end goal to stop the supernova? Hmm. I'm not asking you. I'm asking... I'll find out. Don't answer that question. Let alone in our village. Uh, don't go. What was that you were whistling? What? Was that you whistling? Is the actual thing I asked? Probably. Or actually, definitely. The other travelers carry instruments, so they don't bother whistling. You can pick up their music with the signal scope, you know. Best spot for that is the North Pole. Right reception. The North Pole is marked, marked in red on your mini map, but the Adler Rock is pretty small, moon really. You just go north. Can't miss it. Yeah. Yeah, uh, don't go. Uh. What is this place? Haha. <laughs> Very funny. Oh, stars above your series, ain't you? That's just depressing. Uh, welcome to the Lunar Outpost, which apparently the space program doesn't bother to teach anyone anymore. It's kind of turning into Eeyore. When we first started the Outer Wilds, travelers used to bring their ships here all the time for repairs. Our spacefaring technology has improved loads since then, but the older ships tended to uh, fall apart a lot. Like, more than they do now. Using the outpost to cut down a number of launches and landings taking place in the village, and also the number of fires. Uh, nowadays, though, it's mostly just me up here, raising saplings from Timber Hearth and keeping an eye on things. Uh, don't go. I'm going. I'm gonna whistle sadly. I don't think your radio is working. I'm gonna loot your house. Thanks. Just random net on the bottom. Yeah, that's a lot of flasks. <laughs> nice little place. I wouldn't live here, but you know. It is a nice little place. Alright, let's go somewhere. I don't think I'm going to use the ship here. I feel like I could just walk around enough. To, like get anywhere on this tiny place, kinda. At least I can use the uh, this thing to scout out a little bit more. In fact, what's up north? Go. <clears throat> what's up north? Go. Yep, that's where I'm looking for, actually. Oh, oh. Remember me? <clears throat> I'll check on that soon. 
Well, it missed, so... Hold on. Remember me! Lead the shot a little bit. Nope. I launched that too low, so it's actually orbiting. Whatever. I'll shoot it at there eventually. I can still hear it orbiting. Is this in the North Pole? Yuppers. What? Ooh! Alright. Somebody's playing... What is that? Lantern? Something lantern? Somebody's partying over on the deep... Something? Somebody's partying inside the sun! Alright. Uh, let's read. Esker signal log... Lo, signal scope log. Day 48. Still not picking up Rabex Banjo from Brittle Hollow. Uh, that's what I said. I'm sure they're fine, but I'll feel better once I can hear their music. Day 51. Listen to Cheer play for a while. Unrelated, someone should tell Porphy and Gossin that their flirting is not settled from an aerial perspective. Day 55. Badge of music coming in loud and clear today. Sounds like Rabex doing okay. That oaf. I was worried. Day 63. I thought I heard something strange. I don't know. It's probably nothing. Day 70. No, it's, no, it's back again. Something strange is coming from Timberhearth. Day 76. Okay, I know this is crazy, but the sound from Timberhearth sounds exactly like Phyllis Bar's harmonica. But Feldspar disappeared in space ages ago. Can't be them. Day 88. It's still there. This is creepy. Maybe my signal scope is broken? I'd better talk to Nice. Oh, really? Anything down at the bottom there? No. Let's go somewhere else. Let's go to my ship to uh, orient myself. Actually, that's a good enough space to orient myself. We're gonna need to get some O2 fuel soon, so you know what? Let's just go back anyway, get some more O2. Unidentified signal. You mean you mean him? Uh, can I talk to you anything about anything? Uh yeah, okay. Getting a good spot to, uh, to explore. Uh, what's this one? Nothing. Because I missed. Okay, come on. No, I'm just going to get into the ship. I don't think it's worth all the effort of just... I'm wasting time doing that. I'm just going to keep the suit on. Oops, that's not the button I think it is. There's not like a roll button. I don't have like the. Ooh. Yeah, I don't. That. That's interesting. So I'm gonna explore you. I keep thinking like that E and Q will like roll my ship, but no, I have to like physically do that with like the R button. Alright, what's in ya? Oh. Okay. Okay. All right. Let's first let's check the outer rings. That's the sequel to this game. Anything of note out here? I could just jump high and actually just get an aerial view. No. All right. What am I looking at here? Just constantly spinning. What if I do that? Okay. I put the orb there and it starts getting loud at me. Also, it targets the sun. 
This looks like it's depth or whatever water, the one that's deep. Yeah, it's a... It's tar... It's targeting it for some reason. Also, these spin faster than the others. Is it targeting, like, a specific part of the ocean, the planet? Or is it just being weird? Also, it seemingly... Can't find whatever solar object that is. Nope. Because it just keeps spinning infinitely. Interesting. Let's see what happens. We do this one. Let's get out of the way, our planet. Yep, that's the one it's targeting. I'm pretty sure. But why?